It was a sunny afternoon at the JFK International Airport in New York. Three men, a Frenchman, an Italian, and an American, were waiting at the gate for their flight to Paris. The Frenchman and the Italian were old friends, having met each other during their college days in Paris. They were both excited to visit their home country and reminisce about their youth. The American, on the other hand, was a businessman who was traveling to Paris for the first time. He was a bit nervous about the long flight and being in a foreign country, but he was also excited to explore the city of love and romance. As they settled into their seats on the plane, the stewardess offered them some drinks, and the men began to relax. The Frenchman and the Italian started to catch up, talking about their lives, their families, and their love lives. The Frenchman, who had always been a ladies' man, boasted about his prowess in the bedroom. He talked about how he had made love to his wife four times the previous night, and how she had made him delicious crepes in the morning, telling him how much she adored him. The Italian, not wanting to be outdone, shared his own story about how he had made love to his wife six times the night before, and how she had made him a wonderful omelette in the morning, telling him she could never love another man. The American, who had been listening to their conversation, couldn't help but feel a bit out of place. He had never been one to talk openly about his love life, and he didn't have the same level of experience as the Frenchman and the Italian. But as the conversation continued, the American started to feel more comfortable. He realized that the Frenchman and the Italian were just like him, ordinary men who loved their wives and wanted to share their happiness with others. And so, when the Frenchman asked him how many times he had made love to his wife the previous night, the American, feeling a bit shy, replied, just once. The Italian then sneered, only once? That's all? He followed up with the question, well, what did your wife say to you this morning? The American simply shrugged and replied, don't stop. 